Okay, I have an experience to share. Uh, this experience took place in a um, overall everything else around me in my peripheral and in front of the uh, excuse me in front of the front table that I was sitting at. Uh, everything around me was just uh, dark. It was just like black, and I found myself in these scenes before, and really it puts an emphasis on what's taking place right in front of me. Well, again, I was sitting at this table, and the top of this table was a chessboard. Uh, I was sitting on the side with the white pieces, and there was the black pieces um, across from me on the other side, and there was another chair, and there was, it was very interesting, in the chair across from me, it wasn't so much a person as much as it was a presence, if that makes sense, and it was sort of shadowy, very vague, kind of, and I didn't recognize any features about it. I'm kind of looking at it, but it's almost as if it's there, but not there, sort of almost imperceivable. And I see Rebazar standing on my left-hand side uh, behind me, and he sort of brings in these people. It's like 20 plus people are standing there looking at the board. And I, again, I'm sitting down, and the idea of these people being brought in was to see if they would step up and help, sort of like, you know, take part in the game. Because, again, the tradi traditional idea is that it's a one-on-one, -on -one, but it was trying to see if these people would be, you know, willing to assist and take part in the game and, you know, kind of step up in that way. And it was very interesting that as I'm looking at this group of people, I could see there was kind of an overall consciousness with these group of people that a lot of them just were almost afraid to take part. They were just like, it's too much, that they didn't want to, anything to do with it or they didn't even want to begin to try to take part in some way or figure anything out. So a lot of them walked away. It was actually only one person that had stayed behind. And I, he has sort of had his hand on his chin as if he was sort of considering the situation or looking at the board as he was doing. It was very, very interesting that only one person had stayed. It kind of reminded me of what um, I had heard before and that, um, you know, we don't really want the masses. We're just looking for the certain few who are very willing to step up and do something and really take part, you know, because it's a lot for the masses. It's a lot for the people of the earth to really make that decision. So these sort of one-off individuals who are very willing, you know, again, looking for them to step up. So this was my little experience to share. Thank you. Uh, yes, Jeremy. So you were left with the uh, one person that's uh, wondering what to do again. And yes, um, just like uh, the game of chess, that's why you're there. Uh, who will take on the challenge to figure it out. That's the whole idea. That's the first step in creation is to figure out ourselves and creation and what we're doing here, etc. And, and step at a time, uh, learn to recognize the real awareness and beyond that. So, uh, yes, we are giving many the opportunity and this is really how it is. So you have a few people there, but basically they represent the masses that have been literalized and mind framed according to the systems. And we know this and over and over we go, you know, through these scenarios and this is just how it is until you know those that take the risk uh things start to happen those that don't well they'll be watching as uh things do happen and uh, for the most part it'll be too late because there's a huge preparation there and first you have to be willing to step up to play the game yeah but that's a fun one jeremy um uh, you ought to, again, uh, write that out, uh, make a Facebook group, put it all over the place. Yeah, let them know out there uh, because they uh, everybody's getting the hints uh, in their uh, real side, their uh, dream portals, et cetera, their intuitiveness. And so uh, it's very fortunate for them that we're here. That's very, very real. Yes, thank you, Jeremy.